US lords India's role in the Indo-Pacific. She says it sees India as central to everything that US is seeking to do on the global stage. The head of the Central U.S. Command is expected to visit Israel today to discuss the threat of an Iranian attack against Israel. This as the U.S. forces shoot down 11 drones fired by the Houthis over the Red Sea. U.S. and Japan announced new military deals aimed at countering China, Tokyo and Washington Inc. 70 packs on defense cooperation during Japanese Prime Minister's White House state visit. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un says unstable geopolitical situations surrounding his country mean now is the time to be more prepared for war than ever as he inspected the country's main military university. Senior ruling party politicians in South Korea offered to quit taking responsibility for its heavy defeat in Wednesday's elections, a result that has severely dented the country's conservative president, Yoon suk -yeol. An unidentified terrorist has been killed after an encounter broke out in the wee hours between terrorists and security forces in Frasipura area of South Kashmir's Pulwama district. Hong Kong is set to launch its first Bitcoin exchange traded funds this month. This would make it Asia's first city to offer popular ETFS.